1,000 subscribers! Oh my goodness! Well, hello everyone, it's Mila here. I hope you're all having an awesome day. What on earth, you guys? We hit 1,000 subscribers! That is so crazy! Holy guacamole! Thank you so much, each and every one of you, for supporting this little channel here. Wow, I'm just like, I'm speechless, but I just wanted to say thank you. Honestly, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. Thank you! Today, we are doing the 1000 subscribers special. I was thinking, you know 1000 subscribers, what could be better than using 10 tickets to try and find a villager? So luckily, we still have one empty plot to use. So I think we're gonna go talk to Tom Nook, we're gonna take that plot, we're gonna place it, it's going to be our 10th villager. So you know, 1000, 10, 10, 10, probably doesn't make any sense, but it makes sense to me. <laughs> So quickly before we start this villager hunt, the point is to find a villager within 10 Nook Mile tickets. If you fail to find someone you like, you have to let the plot autofill. Obviously we don't want to do that. I've had so many autofills lately that we don't really want one, but in case we need to gamble, we need to gamble and we're gonna do it. If you're new here, the theme of my island is kind of tropical, so that is like the villager type that we're trying to look for today, but if we don't find a tropical villager, we might find or we might bring someone cute. I don't know, we're, we're just gonna go on this hunt and see what happens. By the way, before we start, one more thing. There is a little giveaway in the description box down below, so in case you wanna participate in that, make sure you check out the rules. They will be in the description box. Anyways, let's get hunting! Let's go! 10 ticket villager challenge, here we go. 1k celebration, that's so crazy you guys. Like honestly, it feels so surreal to me. It just feels so surreal. I just keep staring at this number and I'm like, what happened? We were just like at 100 subs. Oh, it's so crazy. But honestly guys, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. First island of the day, let's go. Okay, so we could be really lucky today or maybe not. <laughs> oh my goodness. Let's go and see who is on island number one. It's a frog. Is this puddles? Yes! Okay. Mm, I'm not sure, is Puddles a peppy? I'm warming up to the peppy personality, but to be honest, like not that much that I would take a third peppy villager to my island. So Puddles is okay. I do like the frog villagers. I don't think any of them are that bad, but um, yeah, we're not taking Puddles, moving on to the next island. Okay, island number two. Who is it going to be? So we need to really be careful here. Like if we see someone we like, we might want to take them home even if we normally wouldn't. I don't know, I just hope this villager hunt challenge is not a disaster because, you know, it could very well be. Oh, who is in there? It's Lyman! Oh, oh my goodness, he's actually on our list! Oh no, but I don't know you guys. Let's go and say hi. What is up Lyman? Okay, well, I love the koala villagers. They are adorable, Um, but we have a koala on the island right now, so I don't know. So this is our second ticket. Lyman is super, super cute. I really like him and he is on our original dream team list. But I don't know, I'm kind of trying to make an island that has like one of each species and we have Gonzo right now, so I don't know about a second koala. We might leave Lyman for now. Who knows, maybe if he is our 10th ticket, we might take him. But I don't want to give up so easily. That was like our second ticket. Oh my goodness, this is like, this is such a hot mess. I can already tell we're gonna end up with an autofill or something. Let's see. But sometimes we're really lucky with like 10 tickets even, and that's kind of what I wanted to do today. Not each villager hunt needs to be like 100 tickets. You can honestly find cute villagers with just a couple of tickets. So that's kind of the point here. The point that we're trying to prove is that 
you don't need millions of tickets to find a cute villager. And I think if we wouldn't have Gonzo already, I, I wouldn't take in Lyman. But I want like a nice mix of villagers. Who is in here? Oh, it's Norma. Hello, Norma. Oh, she's quite cute. She is cute. But we had Patty on the island. Um, She was one of the autofill villagers from the very beginning. Um... I do think Patty, Norma, and Tipper are kind of okay, but you know, we don't want to take an okay villager. Although I really like Norma because she's really cute. I don't know, that was just our third ticket. When we are at like ticket number seven or something, then I'm gonna be more, more careful with who we leave behind. But so far, like Puddles is okay, Lyman is cute, Norma is cute, like Puddles is cute too. So not too bad, not too bad, but who knows, maybe now that we left all the okay looking villagers behind maybe we will just find like rocket and big top now <laughs> anyways you guys thanks for coming to hang out for another villager hunt i hope you enjoy today's villager hunt challenge i hope you enjoy this 1000 subscriber special maybe for 2k we will do 20 tickets so many koalas oh no oh my god okay no way <laughs> I love Sydney. Oh no. Oh, what to do, what to do. I said this before, I think Sydney is adorable. I love the koala villagers. This is really difficult. This is really difficult. Six more tickets. Oh no, you guys. This is why I kind of miss live streaming every once in a while because I really need some help making these decisions. But we still have six tickets. Do we still want to gamble? I love Sydney. But again, a koala? I don't know. I oh! <laughs> I'm gonna gamble it, you guys. I think we're gonna leave Sydney if she is the 10th ticket. I don't know. I'm gonna regret this. I'm gonna regret this so much. I know. Oh, I'm, I'm the worst. I'm the worst. I should take Sydney. But I don't know. Maybe June is out there. I kind of wanna gamble it. <laughs> This is probably a really bad decision, but I want to gamble and we are moving on to the next island. Ticket number five. Let's go. That was a really bad call, wasn't it? Okay, but I have faith. I have faith that we will find someone. Let's go, you guys. Island number five. Maybe it's June. Oh, it's Walt, right? Yes, Walt. Okay, we have a kangaroo already. We already have a kangaroo. Shake, shake. No, 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 no. Oh. <laughs> That is my karma from leaving Lyman and Sydney. Walt is okay, but not my favorite. Besides, we already have a kangaroo and we already have a cranky perso personality type on the island. So, um, yeah, we're leaving. <laughs> oh, I should have taken Sydney, right? Oh no. What am I doing? Me pretending that I have good luck, right? After all these autofills. Okay, let's see. But I'm curious, like I wanna see who can we find within these 10 tickets. What do you guys think? Are we going to be lucky? Is it going to be our lucky 1000 subscribers special? Or are we just ending up with someone tragic? But as I said, you guys, you can still find really cute villagers with less than 10 tickets. Okay, island number six. Oh, interesting. It's Lobo. Is Lobo cranky as well? Um, well, he doesn't really fit the theme and we have Wolf Villager already. So, okay, I'm not gonna shake any more trees because I don't wanna faint. <laughs> Moving on. Lobo is kind of cool, but yeah. If we left Lyman in Sydney, we are okay leaving Lobo. Although we are kind of running low on tickets soon. We have to think about it. Oh no, you guys. <laughs> I'm, I'm a little bit concerned. We have four more tickets, but I do hope you enjoy today's hunt. I do find all these villager hunts kind of fun, like they are something different and they are a nice change to those like 50 tickets or 100 tickets. Oh yeah, 100 tickets we're not gonna do in like ever again. 
This is like way too many tickets. Sister Fruit Island, let's go. Who is it going to be? Who is that? Grizzly? Oh, uh, well, we're not really looking for a cranky personality type unless if it's Camel Frog or Kabuki. Moving on. We are kind of running low on tickets now. What do you guys think of the Sanrio characters? I think it is so freaking amazing that they are adding new villagers to the game. I'm so, so excited. I'm just curious to see what kind of end of the world Hunger Games it's going to be to get these cards, but I have my fingers and toes crossed that they are going to be printing a lot of them because it would kind of suck that they are like hyping these new villagers and the stuff and if we can't really get the villagers or the cards. Let me know your favorite Sanrio character in the comments. I'm super excited for this. Okay, Mountain Island. I'm not a big fan of this island because it usually spoils the villager. Like you can already see their feet. Oh, Bruce! Oh, <laughs> we are finding really good villagers. Obviously, these are not like Raymond and Anka, but I really like Bruce and I've said this before that I would really like to have him over on my Northern Hemisphere Island. I think he would suit the theme really well. I have a lot of deer villagers over on my Northern Hemisphere Island, so Bruce would be a great addition to the family, but we're leaving him because obviously he doesn't fit the theme and we have a cranky villager already. Wait, do we have like two more tickets left? Yes, oh my goodness. Note to my future self, if you do find Sydney on a 10 ticket villager hunt, you take Sydney home, okay? Hashtag regret. Anyways, maybe we get lucky, we have two more tickets. Cross your fingers for me, guys. I hope this is a good villager. Um, yeah, I, I'm not too excited to be auto-filling any more plots on this island, but um, you know, we gotta do what we gotta do. If we don't find anyone cute on these last tickets, Oh, it's Renee. Oh, Sailor Moon Rhino. Mm, well, I guess it's safe to say that we should have brought Sydney home with us. Well. <laughs> Moving on. Uh, so, last ticket, you guys. Last ticket. Who is it going to be? Oh no. I don't- I, I think I'm just used to having, like, endless tickets. Did we mess this up? Did we mess this up? Oh no, you guys. Last ticket. So our options are either to take whoever is on this next island or do another autofill. Crickets, crickets, crickets. Okay, let's see. Please, Orville, send us to an amazing villager. Send us to our number one dreamy June. Come on, just this once. Give us the most amazing tropical villager there is, okay? I have faith. Fingers crossed, you guys. Oh my dear, it's going to be someone awful, isn't it? Let's go, last ticket. Are you ready? Oh no, who is that? No freaking way. What did I do? What was I thinking? Why did I convince myself that I would find an amazing villager on the last ticket? Should have taken Sydney. Should have taken Sydney. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? Well, you guys already know it. We are not taking coach. So, for <laughs> our 1000 subscriber special, we are doing one more autofill by choice. This is the first time that we are doing this willingly because I'm a dummy. I should have taken Sydney. What was I thinking? I don't know, but we're doing it, guys. We are doing it. Um, okay. The plot is still empty. Interesting. Okay, I'm gonna have one more day, but um, shouldn't the plot already be filled? Is the plot not gonna autofill? <laughs> 
imagine me like desperately trying to get an autofill after all these autofills that I did not want. If the plot is not sold on this day, uh, I think we're gonna just take one more ticket and yeah, try to try to kind of autofill it ourselves with the last ticket. Let's see. That is so strange. Like, why didn't the June plot stay open then? Why am I talking when the loading screen is all black? Okay, let's see if the plot has been filled or sold, I mean. What on earth? How is it still not sold? Wow, this game, I swear. Okay, I have one more ticket here. That is so strange though. Is that a thing? Is your last plot not gonna autofill? Well, you know, a girl can try, but this is now our last gamble. This is our autofill we're gonna take. Whoever is on this last island. Are you guys ready? Should have dropped my ladder. It's going to be such a spoiler. Okay, who is in here? Oh dear. It is. Just absolutely awfulness. No, I refuse. I refuse. <laughs> it's my game. I make the rules. We're gonna do one more ticket. <laughs> We're gonna do one more ticket. I swear, just one. Then if it's a duplicate, I think is that Rory? If it's Rory again, we're gonna we're gonna take Rory. I'm gonna go and print one more ticket, you guys. No freaking way. Okay, one more ticket, you guys. I'm the worst, am I? Let's take out one more, one more ticket. So this is our 12 ticket challenge. I'm such a cheater. <laughs> Let's go. Ticket number 12. This is it. I don't care who is on this island. You know, we just need one more, one more shot at this. Let's see. Oh my goodness. Wish me luck. And I promise no more cheating. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. Last island. This is it. Are you freaking kidding me? Guys, I'm declaring it. I have the worst luck in this game i have nothing to say that's absolutely awful i'm sorry if someone likes hans good for you i'm happy but what on earth are you kidding me well i said it this is the last ticket Fine, Hans, come to our island, join all the other weirdos. Tragic villager island. <laughs> uh, I don't know what to say. I think Rory would have been better. I don't know what I was thinking. That was like my karma. You know, it, that happens. Like if you're gonna leave a bad villager behind, you will get even worse. <laughs> it's so bad. Ew. Well, this really makes me think if we want to do another villager hunt challenge ever again. So what did we learn from this experience? Don't cheat. I don't know what to say, you guys. Hans is joining our island and I don't know how to feel about this. I don't like using the term ugly villager, but I have to say that Hans is kind of tragic. Well, you know, this is my karma from cheating. <laughs> Welcome, Hans. You are the opposite of a tropical villager. We definitely, definitely should have taken Sydney. I have no idea what I was thinking. I don't have good luck. What was I thinking, you guys? I'm a little bit shocked, but then again, I'm not surprised. Hans is officially our 10th villager, so we can now even use amiibo cards. I know I can't even be upset anymore. Like, what was I expecting? What was I expecting? Who was I fooling? Guys, this is why I don't get lottery tickets. My luck is non-existent. I can't even be mad. Honestly, I'm just fine with it. We are getting some weird villagers. We're just continuing the theme of this island. Okay, okay. <laughs> Send help. Anyways, once again, thank you so much, you guys. 1,000 subscribers. That is so crazy to me. I, I don't, I don't even know what to say. But thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I 
do hope you enjoyed this this hot mess of a villager hunt once again i will now probably spend the rest of the day trying to kick out someone wish me luck i hope we can kick out maybe klaus or someone we'll see we'll see comment down below if you have any kind of not so popular villagers that you do like are you a hans fan do you like klaus comment down below. You know what? This is a great opportunity to show some love to the villagers that usually people maybe don't prefer. So, you know what? It's fine. Hans is part of the weird villager island family and we're really, um, happy? <laughs> Anyways, you guys, thank you so much for 1,000 subscribers. I appreciate it so so much you don't even know you don't even know thank you i hope to see you all in the next villager hunt bye guys i'm gonna go and cry in the corner for a little bit now